YouTube, it's your boy Chaotic BPR here, and we're gonna uh, show you how to install a track mode videos for your At Games Legends 4KP using a thumb drive. So what you're gonna need is you're gonna need a at least a 32 gig uh, thumb drive, flash drive. Plug it into your computer, and you're gonna go to my Google Drive, which is gonna be in the description of this video. And you're going to download a Playfield video, a Backlash video, and a DMD video of the same title. So you can do all of them, some of them, or just one of them, uh, depending on, you know, the themes that you want. But you can have it shuffle through as well as uh, play just one video. You know, say like you got Attack from Mars, you just want to Attack from Mars uh, a track mode, you can do that. But if you wanted to shuffle multiple, you can just download multiple. So in this video here, I'm going to show you how to do that. Very easy, very simple to do. Just make sure you just get a 32 gig flash drive. So let's go down into the video below, set it up. Uh, yes. Okay, cool. So you're going to go to your flash drive and see, I'm going to use uh, what's called SD card formatter. Uh, it's a 32 gigabyte. I just named it Legends 4KP. I'm going to hit format real quick, and it's going to format the card real quick. All right. So doing that, we're done. We can now go to my attract mode. Now my attract mode, all you're going to have to do is, like I said, I got them labeled as the name of the title and what screen it's going to go on. And it has to be named this way. So and for instance, we've got attack from Mars underscore back glass attack from mars underscore dmd and attack from mars underscore playfield all right i got attack from mars we got uh how to train your dragon godzilla godzilla versus kong jurassic park knight rider kong kung fu panda monster bash snoopy uh star trek the next generation the adams family trolls Twilight Zone and World Cup Soccer is all I've got made so far. Um, you are welcome to use these as much as you want. Um, I will have, be making more in the future. So basically, you're going to highlight one of them. You're going to hit download. Okay, it's going to go to your download folder. So in my case, I got mine stashed in videos. So right here. I have I have several of these already downloaded, ready to go. Let me move this over, and then we're going to do File Explorer, and then open up my SD card. So basically, here's how it's going to happen. Okay, you're going to create a new folder on your SD card, and it's going to be Attract Underscore Mode. All right, do that, and then we're going to take. Jurassic Park DMD, Playfield, Backglass. Slide it over. Let it copy. You know what? Let's go ahead and get Knight Rider, because I just made these yesterday. Slide these over. They don't have to be in individual folders. They don't have to be in any kind of certain order or anything. As long as if they are named correctly, they will play correctly. So, Monster Bash, go ahead and add those as well. So, in general, I got three tables or three track modes ready to go. I got the Playfield, the Backlash, and the DMD. They're already named correctly for you. So, basically, it's just going to be drag and drop for you once you create the track mode folder. Okay? So, create a track mode folder, track underscore mode. And then throw your videos in there, okay? Just like that. And then we'll hit, and then we're gonna hit uh, safely remove drive, eject the drive. Let's head on over to the 4KP. All right, guys, so you're gonna take your flash drive, plug it up in the back of the uh, 4KP. It's going to say USB mount, uh, flash drive has been mounted. You're going to go down to settings and a track mode. I have mine set for 60 seconds. 
And the second option, which is allow track mode in table or in game, um, have that off. In video sound, you can turn on or off depending on if you want it to play, you know, the sound, you know, during the screensavers. Go to page two. Make sure you select, if you have multiple uh, videos, make sure you have it selected as USB list. Otherwise, you can do local and select which videos you want if you want just one to play over and over and over again. Otherwise, go to USB list. And if you click list, it will show you what three you have or what uh, videos you have loaded on the drive. So it's showing JP, KN, and MB, right? So there you go. It's just going to show you the list of what you got. Now you can do shuffle or not. You can have it play in order or you can just do shuffle. I usually do shuffle, especially if I got a bunch of them. And you're done. Literally, all you got to do is just sit here, wait 60 seconds, and it's going to automatically uh, start playing. A few moments later. And it's that easy, guys. So literally, if you want to swap to another one, hit the flipper button. And I'll go ahead and start playing the next one. And you're set up. So anytime that you just leave your machine idle for 60 seconds and you're not in a game, it's going to go ahead and start playing a screensaver for you. And I'm going to go ahead and swap to the last one, which is dress part. Just got to make sure all of them work. Just got on, oh, I forgot we got it on shuffle. Don't shuffle. Come on. There you go. Well, that easy. Uh, and enjoy uh, track modes. So in the future, I will add more, um, especially since I've been getting a lot of requests from like uh, Chucky, uh, Creature from the Black Lagoon, uh, and then a couple of the other, other older ones that I have, I need to redo. So there you go. There it is playing in the background. So guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope this was informative and it'll help you uh, able to install and everything. So please give a thumbs up on the video. Uh, subscribe to the uh, channel. For more, uh, catch me every Thursday uh, for Yo Retro with my co-host, Half a Dozen. We talk about that games as well as other home arcade stuff going on and anything that's pretty much retro. Uh, Wednesdays, we have Arcades Anonymous. Sometimes I'm there, sometimes I'm not, depending on if I'm working late or not. But great bunch of guys. Make sure you subscribe to Arcades Anonymous. And that's pretty much it, guys. Thank you all so much for coming by, and we'll see you all on the next video.